Welcome to this tutorial about setting up a complete control rig for Unreal Engine. Now, this is a little bit of a special case. I'll show you by going to the Epic Launcher. Uh, what we're going to be doing is, if you go to the Epic Launcher Marketplace and you search for Control Rig, you're going to find this project here, which says Control Rig Mannequin. And uh, this is the Control Rig we're going to be setting up today. When, and we're going to do that a little bit by cheating. Uh, so what you want to do is you want to click on the free icon here or the add to cart and add it. And then you want to create a project and then start that up. And I'll see you in the engine. So here we are inside of the engine of the control rig mannequin template project. Now what we're going to be doing is we're going to be copying how they have set up their control rig, but we're going to be making it in a different project. And the reason for that is that there is some kind of issue which I have not managed to figure out quite why, uh, but the, the control rig acts a little bit weird in this one. So if we go to, uh, let's see, we have it under here. You see it under content, control rig, mannequin, and character and then you have a control rig uh, folder and you open up the control rig mannequin here then this is what that looks like uh, click the rig hierarchy so here we have all the bones and then we see all the blue dots are the controls and the spaces according to what we have gone through in the earlier control rig episode if you have not seen that then i'll provide a link down below so you can check that up because there i explain how you can set these things up and today we're not going to actually be doing that we're just going to be um, copying them from this project so what we want to do now is we want to create a new project which we want the control rig to exist in so i'll be creating that project and i'll see you in a moment Okay, here we are inside of a new, fresh, third-person template project. And we're using 4.26 today, if you want to follow along. So I have this one project here, which is the, the project that we're going to be wanting to have the control rig set up in. Uh, and then we have the original Epic uh, control rig example here. So the very first thing we want to do with this new project is we need to go to uh, plugins and we want to type in control rig like so and we want to enable this. Yes, and then we want to restart uh, so we have it available. And once we have this available, we are now able to create our control rig and we do that by going to our mannequin and find our skeletal mesh which is the one that has this purple so the sk mannequin here is our skeletal mesh now if we right click on that we're able to create a control rig here because we enabled the plugin doing so will give us this control rig which we can open up and we can dock it like so compile and save so in the rig hierarchy here you can see <clears throat> we have everything that the other project had when it comes to the, the bones, but we don't have anything of the rest. And the easiest way to get this over and have a project that uh, avoids whatever issue is existing in the, in the mannequin project is to just mark this root and remove it from over here and then all character just crumble like that. And what we want to do now is we want to bring over everything from here. So we'll just mark from root down to the last control over here. We'll just right click, press copy, go back to our other project. And we'll just right click here and we'll click paste. This will bring in all the bones in the same setup as before, but it'll also bring in all the different uh, controls that they have. You can see that everything is new here because it's green. Uh, so they will have all the positions and all the gizmos and all the translations that were existing in other projects. So if we compile and save this now, we have the same setup for all those things. And this is something that works for this particular character. Uh, if you were having a completely different skeleton you would not be able to do this quick fix just to fix this then you would have to set up the whole control rig to to get it work if you had a similar skeleton but some additional bones for example you can probably uh, bring in all of these bones and then just add whichever bones you have uh, 
to, to the different hierarchies where they belong and everything should be fine as well. But for this specific case, when we want to work with this third person character like this, then this works perfectly fine. So what we need to do now is we need to bring in our forward solve and our backward solve for this. So we can just remove this forward solve and just bring everything from over here. So we'll bring in the forward solve first. Like so copy, move it over here, paste. So now we have that over there. We can compile and save. And then we go back again to the other project and we get the backward solve. We copy and we paste. Place them, something like that. So, compiling and saving now, we can do some quick check to see if this is actually working by, for example, grabbing one of these controls and then moving it around a little bit. And then you can see that the arm is following along as it's supposed to. We can grab some other control, and you see can, we can drag things around, and, and everything will follow along as it's supposed to. So, the forward solve and the backward solve, although we didn't check both of those right now but they they seem like they should be working now so this is the setup that we're going to be needing and the reason we did this is because we're going to be needing this in future tutorials that will be coming out soon so that is all i wanted to show today i hope all of this made sense hopefully you found this video helpful if you liked the video leave a like if you did not like it leave a dislike leave any suggestions or comments you might have down below subscribe and share this video if you want to see more like it in the future that is all for now. Keep on learning. Take care.